Lucy is just a, and I, in my mind, she's just a girl um, who is living in Taipei, maybe doing some, a little bit of modeling or, you know, kind of odd jobs here and there. She's a student. Um, and she's, you know, been away from home for six months and she's just, uh, you know, kind of in a transient phase in her life when we find her. And, um, you know, she's, she's kind of figuring out who she is and she's feeling a little bit like she should probably get her life on track. And that's kind of all we know about her when we, when we find her. We shot in Taipei um, for about two and a half or three weeks, and um, I really loved filming in that city. I just loved being able to explore that city, and I think in some ways, just the fact that we were all so tired and jet lagged and um, you know out of our element really um, added to the kind of the disorientation of the character and you know what's kind of her, what the place that she's coming out of when she sort of starts to be affected by this. Um, by this drug. I think the film is, um, I'm, it's what happens to um, this young woman. Um, it's a very, you know, she's put in these sort of um, extenuating circumstances, I would say, um, that really, uh, you know, through a kind of brutal series of events um, lead her to be able to use um, a greater and greater capacity of her brain. And um, it's really kind of, I think she's just a vessel for that um, to take place, really. That's, that's what it's about. It was wonderful working with Troy. He's, he's a... Um, you know, formidable um, co-star in the sense, I mean, he, you know, we didn't speak the same language, but we could communicate very much with our um, expression. He's a very warm person, it seems, so um, even though we were doing scenes that were really violent and cold and, um, you know, brutal, he had, he's so enigmatic, um, his presence, that it was, um, you know, we could kind of communicate just, you know, in a, um, in a kind of a spiritual sort of a way. You know, for me, just to prepare for this film, I wanted to be in really good physical condition because I just wanted to make sure that this character looked capable, even though you don't actually see her um, you know, doing any kind of martial arts movements or anything like that. She, you know, I want you to, I want the audience should be able to think, okay, this girl can handle a gun. Um, you know, and a lot of the movements that, um, that I do in character are, I, you know, are with a lot of intention and purpose. And I want, wanted that, those movements to feel strong, you know, so when you see her, um, you know, how she stands, how she, maneuvers it's with a lot of uh like a you know kind of inner strength and so you know that just comes from being physically capable i only wanted to be aware of what luke had intended this character to be aware of the you know her capacity how she as she grows what you know how what is if how her this, this growing capacity affects her um, intelligence, her ability, what she sees, what she's experiencing. Um, you know, I didn't want that to be, you know, this to be muddled by um, anything that was, nothing that my character would know. You know, these things are kind of happening to her, but, you know, she's not previously aware of what's, of what this next step is. She's just kind of evolving as it happens, you know.